Okay, we're here for our second video in the Commander series. Uh, we're doing the Devour, Devour for Power deck. Uh, it's, it's a green, blue, and black deck. All the, the, the set of decks are on our site as well as the individual decks. Get them before the price keeps going up. We started selling these decks at um, $115 and they just keep going up and up and up. As with the last deck, you get three oversized cards. Uh, two are new, and one is a reprint. Also, all these cards are legal in Vintage and uh, Legacy. You can't play them in Extended or Standard, but they are legal in those formats. So there might be some cards in these decks that change those formats. Um, so the first card is uh, one of the, the large ones, Mythic Rare. Nizumi Graveyard, uh, Grave Robber from Champions, reprint. Uh, another new card. Um, I'll let you read them really fast. Riddle Keeper, another new card. When a, a lot of these cards, you'll uh, look, they deal with um, multiplayer games as well, because EDH or a commander, as it's called, deals with both multiplayer and one-on-one. -on -one. Eternal Witness, another very good card um, from Fifth Dawn reprint. Troll Setic, another reprint. Uh, this is the first set that introduces uh, Hexproof. Uh, they changed um, they changed that your target that spells or abilities your opponent's control. They changed that to Hexproof. So that's also going to show up in M12 as well. Yavimaya Elder. Solemn, uh, they haven't came out. Mirrodin, uh, he's all, he's been popular ever since he came out, uh, so it's kind of nice to see him again. Braun, uh, he is one of those graveyard effects. If you have a forest and him in your yard, uh, all your guys get trample, and then wonders the same thing, but flying in islands. Um, Sewer Nemesis, another new card. I'll give you a second to read him. His power and toughness are equal to the number of cards in the chosen player's graveyard, and whenever a player casts a spell, that player puts the top card of his or her library into their graveyard. Gravedigger, uh, Lurgroif, reprint, Dreamboard Muse, reprint, Mortivore, Desecrator Hag, Mole Drifter, Acidic Slime, Vulturous Zombie, Dark Hatchling, Extractor Demon, uh, Scythe Scepter, another new card. When he deals damage to a player, uh, each opponent discards a card. Each player who discards a card with the uh, highest converted mana cost uh, loses life equal to that converted mana cost. Uh, Rexel, that's a mythic from World Wake. Forush the Hunter, you also get a big one of him. Triskvelius. Uh, the Eel, Butcher of Malakar from World Wake reprint, uh, Patron of the Nizumi, uh, another reprint from uh, Champions block. Uh, here's a new card, uh, Damien, uh, Sage of Stones. You also get a large one. Death Touch, skip your draw step at the beginning of your uh, upkeep. If you have fewer cards than seven, you draw equal to the difference, so you have seven cards in your hand every turn. Pretty good. Cost uh, seven though, but pretty solid. Uh, Ravnica reprint. Avatar Woe. She's always pretty tough to deal with, especially when graveyards are big. So she couldn't cast her for two a lot, probably in EDH. Artist in the Kozilek, 10 9 big creature. Uh, Soul Ring, $8 a card, right in there. Uh, some signets here Demir and Golgari. Lightning Greaves again, Quick Creature Gets Shroud, $4 card. Simic Signet, Oblivion Ring, or Oblivion Stone, sorry. Uh, blow Everything Up's always good. Vow of Wilderness, Woda Flight, Vow of Malice, Memory Erosion, Rare from Shards, Great Pact from many core sets, and Tribute to the Wild. Spell Crumple, 
Factor Fiction. It's been reprinted again. Uh, it's always a good card. This has been one of my favorite cards of all time. I love that card. Relic Crush. Uh, here's a new card. Uh, this is uh, the uh, Mechanic Join Forces. Uh, this is new to this. So starting with you, each player may uh, pay any amount of uh, mana and then each player draws X card where X of the mana paid. So Join Forces is where anyone's allowed to use it playing the game. Another Join Forces card, um, Shared Trauma. Starting with you, each player may pay any amount of mana. They put X cards of his or her library into his graveyard. So it's a mill card. This deck you kind of want to mill yourself with. Uh, sign and blow, but you probably also could win milling them. Stitch Together. Cultivate. Windfall. Windfall's broke. Um, that card's devastating. Big type 1 card there. Um, buried Alive. Obviously it's good in this deck. Put three, or, uh, put three of your creatures into your yard. Um, Siphon Mind. Uh, each opponent discards two cards. That's a new card. Rise from the Grave. Siphon Flesh. Living Death. That combos with this deck insanely. Get all your guys in your graveyard into, into, into plays. Insane. Uh, Baron Moore, that Commander Tower from the Verse video where you add mana of your general. Uh, Demir Aqueduct, Dreadship Reef, Golgari Rot Farm, Jawar Isle Refuge, Lonely Sandbar, Ruptured Spire, Simic Roof Chambers, Sophagos, Temple of the False God, Terramorphic Expanse, The Thicket, and then your Forest, your Islands, and your Swamps. So this is the second deck. Um, Devour for power. Uh, a lot of good cards in there. Uh, a lot of rares. So pick it up on the site when you get a chance, and we'll go to the next one.